Anybody else? Because I'm going to go to break because I have, I have so much to say and I have so much to get to about why this president was elected, why he said what he said. Everyone keeps pretending that it's about economics and it's about the uh, the, the worker who is who is voiceless in the Midwest, but it's not about you. We all know. Yeah, that's, that's, a that's a throwaway. That's that's a throwaway. Yes. It's, 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 it's no, really not entirely, but it is a big part of how we got because it's for people who did not prioritize racism. Okay, are you going to tell me during this election that he didn't say racist things or exhibit racism? No, okay. even, even so if, if you, you, if you prioritize, if you prioritize racism in any way, how could you support this person if you if you prioritize that? So I can't. If someone says something about women or something something about any minority group or any person, if someone calls out someone's wife and says and compares them and says, my wife is, is prettier than your wife, it, that sort of behavior. If you say, what do you have to lose? If you call uh, NFL players sons of bitches, if you say people uh, should be killed, Mexican and then rapists. Mexicans are rapists, and then you say people should be killed, and then they're exonerated, then what, that, means, that means that you looked at your pocketbook of whatever priority you had above Racism, Don, and you placed what? it there, and you kept pushing it down and making excuses for it. And sadly, women, especially women of color, and black people, and Hispanics, and brown people, and Muslims, don't have that luxury to do it. We'll be right back. Um, I have